Hey YouTube friends and family, how is everyone doing this morning? I hope everybody is doing blessed and well this morning, okay? And welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video with Cooking with Cheryl, okay? Yes, in Cheryl's Spiritual Kitchen, okay? Yes, so today I have a good little air fryer recipe for you guys, you know? I've been looking online, you know, for different, you know, air fryer recipes, like, I used the air fryer a couple of times, you know, but not online. This is my first time doing it on camera for you guys, okay? So, what I want to do today is just some lemon pepper. I'm going to do some lemon pepper air fryer chicken thighs. And I'm going to do, here are the chicken thighs. I have four of them that's uh, lemon washed and washed very well. And I haven't seasoned them yet. I'll let you see me do that. And then I have some potato wedges that I'm going to fix with them that I have cut the potatoes in wedges. There are the potatoes ready to be seasoned. So they're both going to go in the air fryer, okay? But we're going to do the chicken first, and then we're going to come back and do the, uh, the potato wedges, okay? So what we're going to do is I'm going to put you down here so you can see me um, season the chicken, and then we'll get started, okay? Come on. Oh, don't forget, <laughs> grab your tea, grab your coffee, and come on over here and cook with me this morning, okay? Yes, come on. But before I get this video started, you know I want to say a prayer, you know. So let's get this prayer, and then let's get this video going, okay? Now, and the prayer goes like this. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He leadeth me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For thou art with me. Thy rod, thy staff, thy comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil. My cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. In Jesus' name I pray to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Okay, yes, and this is the day that the Lord's had made for us. We will rejoice and be glad in it, okay? So come on, let's cook. So now I'm gonna put you down so that I so you can see me season the chicken and then place them in the air fryer and all that good stuff. So yeah. Let me see if I can put you down. I may be able to get you even closer. Let's pop that. Ooh, ain't that lovely. God is so good. Hey, that's even better. Okay, so let's do this. We're going to start seasoning these. I got the air fryer already um, plugged up. So, yeah, we're going to start with some garlic powder. And you want to season, you know, your meat well. Onion powder. That was onion. Garlic. Powders. And I like this too. It's like a rub, Famous Dave's. And I'm going to put some of this, most definitely. This is really good. Frank's Stinging uh, Honey Garlic. I like this. And I think this is going to be good on this lemon pepper because I'm making a lemon pepper sauce for these after they come out of the air fryer when they're nice and crispy. Ooh. Got to wash that off. For sure. Okay, because I don't want to be touching my seasonings. Okay, now, here we go. Now we're going to put this on the side. I like this. If you haven't tried this, you guys, you guys might want to. It's really good on meat, especially chicken. Well, it's good on anything, but chicken is really good. So honey garlic seasoning blend with a little bit of spice to it. And then I want to put, okay, on this side, the same thing. I'm going to come some garlic powder, onion powder. And I want to put some papri smoked paprika. I like smoked paprika. And I'm going to put some pepper. Okay. 
Okay, now I'm just gonna get my hands in here and mix all of this up. Make sure every piece is seasoned up under the skin too, cause you know that top of the skin always kinda lifting up. I just want it to be nice and coated. One. Don't be scared. <coughs> oh Lord. Mm, this is... <coughs> oh, excuse me. I'm breathing in this seasoning. Okay, two. Nice and seasoned all the way over. Three and four. Yes. Okay. We have our chicken nice and seasoned. Until I get ready to season my potatoes, I'm gonna put them back in this bowl and put them in some cold water so that they won't turn brown because if you leave your potatoes out too long, they will brown on you. And these are nice and fresh and nice and white. So I'm just gonna pour some cold water over here on them until I get ready to season it. Okay, put that to the side. Now, I'm going to, let's see how many can I fit in here? Uh, see, this is the inside. So, I'm gonna see if I can fit. Maybe I might be able to do both of them at the same time, y'all. Let's just see. Let's just see. Okay, here's one that I'm going to put. Two. Oh, yeah, I can. I'm going to fit all these in here. Oh, yeah. All four of these. Oh, yeah. Stay nice. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to get this out the way. Excuse me, y'all. I'm going to get this pan out the way and get it ready. that out in a second okay and now here is the chicken and so since I see that I could fit all four of those in there what I'm gonna do is season up my to use the, um, some salt and pepper on those just a little pepper I'm gonna use a little garlic salt I mean a little garlic powder I'm sorry and a little paprika there and I'm going to put some uh, of these on this potatoes too mm. and then I am going to put some parsley and then because they're potatoes I'm going to put a pinch of salt just for taste that should be enough okay and then I'm going to kind of Shake these up. Nice potato wedges. Yes. Woo -hoo. Look at that. You see? And there's the potato wedges. Now, what I'm going to do, and I also want to put some parsley on the chicken. Now, I am going to bring out this one and place my potatoes in there, just like that. So now you have the potatoes and you have the chicken, okay? So, in goes 
close to both. Get that out of the way. Pull that out of the way. Okay. So now we are going to set this on. I'll turn it on. And we're going to do... We're going to do... Three fifty air fryer, three fifty for nineteen minutes, and then we're gonna do the second one. So we're gonna do the potatoes on twenty minutes, and we're gonna do the meat on twenty minutes air fry. 390 for 20 minutes. Yeah. Now, we have both of them going. I want to show you if you can see. Let me see if I can bring you to see. I'm going to turn this around this way. Yeah. So, you have both of them. This one is on 19 minutes. That's on 19 minutes. And they're both going, number one and number two. Okay? So, we are going to... Okay. So, now, up here. Now. Okay. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to let those cook for about halfway through, maybe about, mm, for about 10 minutes. And then I'm gonna, we're going to pull it out and check it, maybe flip it over, put it back in there to let it go for the rest of the 10 minutes. Same with the potatoes. 10 minutes see how crispy they are if I want them crispier then I'll let them go a little bit longer if they're cool to where I want them after 10 minutes then I'll take them out and they'll be done okay meanwhile I'm going to get my butter sauce done okay I mean my lemon pepper uh, my lemon pepper sauce done so hold on one second excuse me so and what I have here in this bowl is some lemon juice this is some lemon juice i have here okay and then i am going to melt some butter Then, yeah, so I'm going to melt the butter in that microwave. I'm going to add um, a little bit of seasoning to that, not too much, some parsley, and then when the chicken comes out, we're going to pour it over the chicken, okay? And then you'll see how it's done. So, yeah. And this is just a stick. I don't even know if I'm going to use it all because I may not need it all. But I don't want to. I just want to let the heat from what's already melted kind of melt the rest of it. And I'm going to get a spoon, a little spatula, should I say. So to this, I'm going to, let's see, pull this back so you can see. All right.
right-handed, but I want you to see, so um, I don't want to hold it with my left hand, so I'm going to stir with my left and pour it with my right, so then you just add the butter gradually to the lemon sauce, to the lemon juice, like so. And then I'm going to add some of this. I like this. It has a little slight And then I'm going to add some parsley. And I'm going to add some pepper. There you have your lemon pepper butter sauce. And I'm going to pour this over the chicken once it's done. You can, ooh, ooh, the pepper. Ooh, excuse me, bless me. Ooh, excuse me, bless me, Lord. Ooh. I want to taste it. Mmm. Good. So to this, I do want to add a little touch of salt and a little bit more butter. Some garlic. go right there mmm this is gonna be so good drizzled on that chicken oh one more thing I'm gonna add to this one more thing that I want to add to this just to give it that little touch of sweetness and that is gonna be honey yeah. Don't knock it till you try it, y'all. Yep. So it's going to be a lemon pepper honey sauce. <laughs> okay. So, we got two more minutes. Before, let me see. That's it right there. Hey man, that is it. So, we're going to put our uh, lemon butter sauce to the side. And then, yeah. We're going to put that to the side. Hold on one second. All right, so we put the lemon butter sauce to the side, and we're going to wait till this gets down to 10 minutes. We're going to open it, see where it's at, flip it over, and let it continue to cook. Okay? Get your coffee. You got your tea? You got your coffee? Mm. So good. I'm going to put these seasonings off. Up. Up. And by the time I do that, this is almost down to 10. Well, one of them is on 1049. Okay, let's see. Now 
I'm going to put you down so we can see what it's looking like. This one is on 10.33. Oh, it says fries 28 to 32 minutes. So I might be leaving those in a little bit longer. Let's see. We're going to see what the fries are doing. Okay, they got a long way to go. So we're going to let them continue to fry. And the chicken as well has a long way to go, if you can see. Both of them. Mmm, it smells so good, though. Okay, so we're going to let those continue to cook because they have a ways to go, the both of them. And then we're going to come back when they're done, and I'm going to show you how it all looks, okay? So, stay tuned, and don't go far. So, okay, so we're back, and what I did, it, the, whole, the first 20 minutes has it ran out, and this is what it is. This is what the fries look like. This is what the chicken look like. So, the fries can be crispier for me, so I set it at another 20 minutes. And the chicken, at this point, I am going to turn over. It looks really, really good. And I'm going to turn over on the other side now. And I'm going to let it continue to cook on this side, okay? So we're going to put it back in there for another 20 minutes. And then we'll be back when 20 minutes is up. Okay, so the chicken, this is how it looks right now. It has about seven more minutes to go but right now I'm going to take this butter sauce and I'm just going to brush it on here and then I'm going to let it cook the rest of the way oh yes that's what I'm going to do I like this air fryer I really do and I'm going to actually turn them over again now and I'm going to brush this side Woo! Oh, yes. This is coming out really good. Like I said, I fixed pork chops in this since I had it. That's really all I ever fixed in this since I got it. And they came out really well. But uh, this chicken, oh, yeah. Mmm. It smells so good, you all so good so I'm just gonna brush this lemon pepper honey drizzle on here and then I'm gonna put it back in here oops I made a mess there and I'm gonna let it continue I'm gonna store the rest of that uh, lemon pepper juice you better believe it and I'm going to let it go the rest of the way. Y'all want to see what the uh, fries look like? Look at those fries. Woo-hoo! Them look so good. Let me get that you get. Oh, yes. Look at those. And I'm going to kind of shake them up again. And put them back in there. Woo! Really coming out well. So, I'm going to see you guys in about five more minutes. And everything should be completely done all right see you soon okay we are back and they are done and let's see the outcome okay yes it's a nice crisp browning on them this is the fries completely done i want to say 40 minutes 20 minutes and that's the chicken oh man so i'm gonna plate this up like okay hold on let me get my, uh, woo -wee. This is so good. Because I wanted my, um, mm. Mm, that looks so good. Oh, yeah, that looks so delicious. Mmm, and now the 
These nice potato wedges, should I say? Oh yeah. What a great lunch. And I just want to show you how good these fries and everything look inside. They so crispy on the outside. And these both need to be washed. You have it. Air fry lemon pepper chicken. And you can also, I can also take now that it's done, even though I, you know, and just kind of like, yeah, drizzle some more over the top, some of this butter lemon sauce. Now that it's done, mmm, delicious. Now, look it. Mmm. That's it. Air fried lemon pepper chicken and potato wedges. So, let's try one. This one right here. And a couple of wedges. Wait a minute. What is my little... Oh, here it is. And some wedges. Just show you. Let's just see how it tastes. Okay, first we're going to start with these potatoes. Look, look at the inside. Oh, they are so delicious. Then you put a little bit of this in there and put a little bit of body. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, let's try. Mmm, that's so good. They are nice and tender on the inside. Mmm. No so good. I'm gonna get a fork for this chicken. Mm. Mm. Look at this chicken. It's so juicy. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Well, here it goes. Let's try it. so good. You can taste the seasoning, the lemon, the little touch of sweetness from the honey, the garlic. Mm, it's so good. It's so good. Love it. Mm. Mm. And these potato wedges. Look at that. So moist on the inside. A crunch on the outside. Mmm. These are delicious. It'll be a great lunch or a great dinner for your family. I'm gonna season it, put in the air fryer, and let it do its thing. Come on, stick them. Mmm. The seasoning is absolutely all throughout it. It is so good. Mm, mm, mm. So good. Look at that fly. Crunchy. On the outside, and so tender on the inside. This is delicious. Mm. Oh, that concludes my video today.
have it. Honey lemon pepper chicken. Air fryer honey lemon pepper chicken. Or lemon pepper honey chicken. <laughs> However you want to call it. With potato wedges. Mm. It got a little touch of heat to it. <clears throat> From that stinging garlic honey seasoning. That's a real good seasoning. If you haven't tried it, I'm going to show it to you again. Because... I didn't put no heat to this, no cayenne pepper, and I didn't use no Tony's. So this is the only thing that I put in here that had heat to it, really. Besides pepper, but you know, pepper just gives you a pepper taste unless you use a gang of it. It really don't, you know, be high. I don't use that much pepper to where it's just like, oh, okay. This is really good. Nice. Try it. It's so good on chicken. It really is. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm -hmm. So, that is my video for today. Oh, yeah. That is good. So, that is my video for today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you want to try this at home with your family, please do. It's really good, okay? You basically just season, put it in there, sit it, set it, and forget it. It's one of them type of meals. Set it and forget it. Remember that commercial? What <laughs> set it, <clears throat> excuse me, set it and forget it. That's what you do with these air fryers. You season up your food, you put it in there, and you just sit it, set it, and forget it. Okay, so <laughs> that's what you do with this meal season, put it in there, set it, and forget it until it stops. And then, you know, unless you have to let it go a little bit longer, then you put it on some more and set it again and forget it again until it's done. Okay, so. Air fryer. Try it. They, excuse me. They come in really, really handy. Okay? Alright. So, until the next video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment if you like to. Talk to me. I will talk back. And until the next video, God bless you.